test, 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 no. No batteries? Yeah, yours is... Mine's working? Yeah. Yours is... It doesn't look like it's working. We have audio. Yeah, we do. Cool. Now we do this. Audio here. Hello. Hi. So here we have Anel. He's going to be fixing a board that doesn't recognize the battery, and it has 12.23 volts on its PP bus rather than 12.56 volts. So Anel, can you tell people why it matters that you have 12.23 volts on PP bus G3 hot rather than 12.56 and how this relates to battery recognition? All right. So uh, the show on screen. What? And show on screen. On screen. Oh, on the yeah. desk camera. I mean, on on, no, on the oh, board oh, view. Oh, schematic. oh, board view. Cool. Uh, board view. So. Remember, they 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 have they can't see this stuff, but you yes, see. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. So here we have our thirty three thirty two board that I'll be working on. We are getting twelve two on our P bus, and this the reason for that is, well, what did Lewis do? Pins. There we go. Okay. So, <coughs> the reason why we have 12.22 is that uh, the SMC is not communicating with our battery. Now, usually when the SMC communicates with the battery, we get an extra 0.3 volts, and that's what brings it up to 12.56. So, here on our battery connector, we have these two things right here. Uh, Does the SMC and... talk to the battery to make 12.22 versus 12.5 well, or to the, something else? It talks to the ISL. All right, because so, there's going to be some pedantic fuckface right, that yeah, corrects you. Right. Later. The battery goes to the ISL, and the ISL goes to the SMC. So, from from our battery connector, it goes to our ISL six two five nine, and from the from the ISL, it goes to our SMC, right here. So I'm gonna open up the schematic for the ISL, right here. Pins ten and eleven, SCL and SDA. These two talk to the SMC, which m makes it gives it battery recognition. And that's what we are liking here. So we're going to look at our board. And this board has been worked on before. We couldn't fix it. We tried contacting customer, and they did not want to respond to us. Look at the time. i got to go. So our battery connector right here. You said you had no family. Looks a little like this. Jeez. Now, as bad as this looks, I've checked. This is totally fine and working. The real problem we have is that, um, let's see, our SMC, yeah. So what I've measured before, I wanted, oh, I measured the voltages on these two pins, pins five and six. As you see, if we go back to our board view, pins five and six would be located right here. So five, six, SMC, SM bus, SMC five, G3, SDA and SCL. These two communicate with the SMC and they should be three volts. Granted they get this, they connect to this pull-up resistor right over here. These two pull-ups which connect from 3V42 and 3V42 right back into the SMC. So there are two usual ways that this fails. Uh, behind door number one the SMC is bad, or behind door number two, either the SMC or the ISL 6259 are shorting that data line to ground. And uh, you can typically tell if it's shorted to ground by doing a diode measurement with the multimeter. And you can tell if the SMC is bad if 
after you've tried a new ISL6259, it's still 12.23 volts. At which um, point it's time to cry. Yeah. All right, so we're going to turn this on. Oh, <laughs> wrong button. So we have power, we have fan spin, and we have green light, which makes me think that our SMC is okay since we have green light and there is communication for that. But if we measure our two pins here on SDA, we get 3.2 volts, which is it being told to, to turn on. But on this one, we are getting 100 millivolts. So these, this pin connects to a pull-up resistor as well as this one, so they both should be 3 volts, but we aren't getting that. Whoa. Am I being trolled by the software again? No. Yeah. No, 37 millivolts. That's okay, okay. <clears throat> so we're going to turn that off, and now we're going to check our ISL. Now, in the notes, it did say that he's replaced the SMC and he's replaced the ISL, and you can see clearly over here, we can see that the ISL has been replaced, touched up, and all that good stuff. And if you look at our SMC, those resistors are there, and they seem to be fine. This SMC looks totally fine to me. But what I've figured out is that when I go... Uh, is it range? No. Hey, Lewis? Yes. How do I uh, change to, like, diode mode and all that good stuff? Hit shift. Shift? Oh, shift. There you go. Oh, you were just in diode, and now you lost No, it. I want to be in uh, continuity mode. You know, oh, you when go. you touch, you get that beeping. When it says this, is that, that means you have to sign right? Yes, So if I were to touch... Actually, let's go to our board view so you guys can see. I'll help you out. So we're going to measure continuity between this, this resistor to our ISL. So that should be on pin 10. So that resistor being measured right now, this one to pin 10. Do we get a beep? As you can hear, we are getting a, a nice continuity reading. And now we're going to check our other resistor, this one over here. And we're going to check that to pin 11. Move that to the side. And we are getting nothing. Not a single beep at all. So my theory here is that one of uh, yes, one of our lines must have been not is not connecting to that resistor. So what connects to pin eleven that we can check continuity on? So we're gonna go back to our board view and we're gonna check from here to this pro point, see if there's continuity from there at least. So we're gonna put it on pin eleven the fourth pin on this ISL and to here and we are getting a beep but from this probe point to that resistor we are not getting that same beep so what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna run a jumper straight to that resistor and see if that fixes our problem Uh, Justin, I do not have my own personal YouTube channel. I do not stream. I do not make videos. I just like to work. Don't, don't you make videos about your boat or something? No. Can I show my boat? Yes, show your boat. <laughs> if you guys would like to come on my boat, where is where's the cam for that? 